Christmas. Well, today is Christmas and I got a special gift for you. I started uploading the uh, pop videos, uh, tutorial videos uh, here on YouTube. There should be an annotation somewhere to the playlist. Now, when you click on the playlist, as of today, there's only going to be one video up, but every day for like the next month and probably even after that, there's going to be a new tutorial video. Uh, so they're already scheduled to go up. So when you click on that, you might watch one or two or so many. You might get to a point where it says video unavailable. That's because it hasn't been uploaded yet. Wait another day and it should be uploaded. Um, also, I might as well comment on some things. I've had a lot of complaints about the name of the game. Obviously, uh, and I mean, I knew this. I just didn't realize how bad it was that pissed off is, is something you shouldn't say. I don't see how being pissed and being angry are really all that different. If you shouldn't be one, you shouldn't be the other. But I understand a lot of people are concerned they don't want their kids playing a game called Pissed Off Penguins. Um, I've had um, a number of people uh, suggest Peeved Off Penguins. Once again, I really don't see the difference. You're just changing the words, but you're meaning the same thing. But I tell you what, in the actual game and in the tutorials from here on out, so after like the 20th tutorial, um, I will refer to the game as Pop. And when you download the game to play it, it won't have the word pissed off anywhere in the actual game, um, except for maybe in like a credit file separate from the game. Um, it will all be called Pop. So if you want to call it Peeved Off Penguins, if you want to call it Pissed Off Penguins, if you want to call it Pop, that's fine. Um, but let, just to let you know, the game should be kids safe because it won't have the word pissed off in it. Pissed in it. Uh, I'll stop saying that now. So I should have warned you at the beginning of the video that I was going to be saying that because your kids are around. Um, and um, right now, I, uh, well, it's Christmas. So I'm kind of busy right today. It's actually Christmas Eve when I'm filming this. Um, I've been working on getting all the rewards for everyone who backed me. Um, and uh, I'll have final numbers at the end, but a lot of people ask me where all the money I'm collecting is going to, and I thought that was kind of clear. It's going to me for my time working on this. People have asked, why does it cost so much to create a video game? Um, my, back, my Kickstarter was, all goal was only $2,500, which is really nothing, uh, considering the amount of effort that's going into this. But just to make things clear, the money that's left over is going to go to me. That's what I was raising money for. Um, and it's not going to be nearly as much as you think because um, Amazon and Kickstarter is taking like 10% of the money. Uh, so that's $250 there uh, approximately. Um, and ordering things for you guys like um, flash drives, custom flash drives and stickers and t-shirts and posters and all that stuff. I haven't ordered all of it yet. But I've already spent about $500 on that, and it's probably going to be another couple hundred dollars. Plus, you know, postage for mailing that stuff. I've got, uh, I think it was over 100 backers. I want to say like 120-something. The majority of them are getting something. So, depending on how big the package is, it's going to be a minimum of postage is what, like 40-some cents now? We'll say 50 cents. I mean, it's going to be another 50 to $100 just in postage. So, don't think that I'm rolling in the money here. I just want to make that clear. I just was hoping to get a little bit back for um, the effort because I am putting a lot of time into this and I'm going to be, still be putting a lot of time into it. Um, there should also be a link in this description, if I haven't forgotten, to the files that are now available to the public. Uh, everyone who backed the project is getting early access and has access to a bunch of files already. You guys can check out the link below or just go to pop uh, filmsbychris.com forward slash pop link to that in the description as well um, and there should be a link to project files where you can get the files. Now there aren't any uh, standalone executables for any operating system yet. Right now it's just a blend file so you have to install Blender. Uh, preferably I'm designing it in Blender 2.60 but if you get uh, probably 2.61 I think just came out it probably will work on that too, um, but there should be uh, in that also, in that project file links, uh, a place where you can download uh, Blender 2.6 just for future reference in case it gets hard to find. Um, obviously in the future there will be standalone executables or at least installables, uh, installables, installable packages um, for all the different operating systems. That's another thing, I've mentioned this in many videos, but people don't seem to understand. I'm using the Blender 3D game engine, which is free and open source. Uh, 3D uh, rendering engine. People still keep on asking me if this game is going to run on Android. 
it will run on Android the day that they port Blender to Android. That's way over my head. I have no clue how to do that. Um, if it's even possible, I'm sure it's probably possible, but I don't know how much work it would take. But if Blender ever runs on Android, well, then my game will run on Android. So anything Blender runs on, this game will run on, so just to make that clear. Um, now, if you're running Android, you might be able to install some form of uh, Linux on there and get Xorg running and, and possibly uh, compile an ARM uh, version of Blender, because I have seen Blender running on the Nokia N900, which is the uh, phone I have. Um, I haven't done it myself. So just trying to clarify that. Um, and now that I've been rambling for a while, I'll, I'll have more updates in the near future. You know, the next week is going to be busy between Christmas and, and uh, New Year's Eve. But there will be a pop tutorial video every day uh, for the next couple of weeks. As well as I will still be posting uh, Blender, uh, Bash videos and all the other videos I normally do. They might be a little scarce the next week or so just because of the holidays, but there will be some. And that's about it. Have a Merry Christmas!